Right on here, Clara Tanner. Now, do you have baby pictures of her too to show me? So, are you getting along quite well? Your daughter's safe and sound, Clara Tanner. Yeah. So, you know Shenhua too, Clara Tanner? Naturally. Save for Ganyu, who spends the majority of her time in Liyue Harbor. All the Adepti living today are acquainted with Shenhu to some degree. Thanks for you, Ab. Cool. Adeptus name anyway. <laughs> Nothing. Why pray tell which Shen Hu She's not a fucking turkey, you moron. Uh, so what's Shen her deal Hu anyways, Clara Danner? Because clearly there's no human I know that can lift that boulder. One first found Shen Hu by chance in a Scary cave. Dumb. One was passing by and sensed the presence of a god's remains. God's remains. Being of an ever vigilant disposition, one entered immediately to inspect the scene. <laughs> Inside was Shen Ho. Sound like then aged yeah. around six years old. In her hand, she held a dagger with which she was confronting a monster that was the god's remains incarnate. That she was able to endure such terrible danger was due not only to her strong willpower, blood but luster. also to the bloodlust and homicidal instinct with which she was born. But she uses to survive with. One dealt with the monster. Yet she still refused to lower her guard. She even pointed her dagger in one's direction and remained ready to strike. Only after she was satisfied that one had no intention to cause her harm, but did she or her. finally relent. She then passed out without uttering a single word. In other words, if you hadn't passed by that day? Not necessarily. Who Upon one's that? arrival, one could sense that the god's wrath was gradually receding. That's not what Pai my man. Cloud retainer. So Alright, she's stupid, I forgot. Would... One decided to adopt her. Never would have guessed! Indeed. It is one to whom she refers. Xian He has an extraordinary constitution, making her well adapted to practicing the Adepti arts. All the Adepti cherished her talents. And so we were willing. So all of you are homicidal. However, her homicidal urges did not subside with age. Who she is? Rather, they grew stronger day by day. And that's why she has those binds on her. Red ropes have indeed served to keep her calmer and more content. They also seem to have rendered her. She seems expressive enough to me. Expressive. What are we looking at? Ning Guang once made a bold assertion that, that this day. is to be the era of the contract between Liu Wei and the humans. Well, one is most curious to observe how she will respond to the coming storm. Let us conclude our conversation here for today. One has occupied enough of your time. Because when you don't care about me, do. Ah, stop sure it. You know, I'm always rest. here. Listening. So I went outside to check and caught sight of my master. On top of this, you have been acting very strangely around me this morning, <laughs> causing me to suspect that my master must Sorry have told about you that. everything I wish me. I could just, you know, casually take in that you're a homicidal maniac. After all, master is... Master. <laughs> Still, though you mistook me for an adeptus, you never treated me as distant and unapproachable. Instead, you treated me as you would a friend. Well, you know, let's not look at the last episode. <laughs> for this... I am very grateful indeed. From now on, you're our friend! I don't know quite what it entails in terms of what I have Let's to do. Let's see it through, shall we? I say I like the title, friend, very much indeed. Great! Well, it's got a nice ring to it, up, We should start searching for the other two items on the list. Yeah, I'm gonna okay. take off. See you later. See ya, buddy. Okay, Try to cause one for me. My He's a real protagonist of the Inazuma Argon Quest. They say it resonates with visions. Resonates with visions. All right, this chorus. Hi, TT. Could take some work. <laughs> what? But if you stick with it, you'll find. They finally listen to something. Actually, something we want to hear from the developers and put the characters in the background. That's tricky. I kind of forgot we're talking here. It's all but unheard of on the then, market. Then where do we start? Uh, I'll sort that out. I was kind of hoping on that, Shenhe. Oh, uh, you got this then? Yes. I have been training with the Adepti for years. I know a thing or two about making sigils. We'd appreciate that. When we first met, I told you I came for the Jade Chamber, not the contest. 
In fact, I came specifically to mm. deliver Adepti sigils. <laughs> they know Ningguan's only sort of defense is the Jade Chamber. The Jade Chamber. So she sent me to. So let's get this Adepti straight. So the Adepti just Adepti. sanctioned her to destroy the Jade Chamber for a second time because they already know Osail is coming. Master also said she hoped that I can take this opportunity to rejoin human society, but now that I'm here. I wonder if I've been removed from the world for too long. You fit in the second you feel. You fit it, if you ask me. Maybe it won't work for me to stay here after all. But either way, I'm very glad to have met you. We'll always have a connection. So if you're ever feeling down, come find me on my ship. There'll be a drink waiting for you. Me too, Thank please. You. So. Master Zhang, I'll need to use your facilities to make the sigils. Uh, we're already on the day chamber? Combine the Adepti sigils with the Wonder Cores and insert them into the Jade Chamber's control compartment. Once the tethers are released, it will soar into the sky. <laughs> Thank you all for your work. Miss Yun, I've already heard something about the reason for your involvement. You are looking for a venue for your new opera. Who's gonna you? have the friend too? That's right. Lady Ningguang. What would you say if I proposed now that we stage your my first lady performance right here? Right here? The Jade Chamber offers a splendid Wait, what about the people? How the hell are you gonna... ...and the bustling city. It is fitting for the finest performance to be hosted in the heavens. I can I'm a little no worried it might be a little too much for her, but she is a professional. <laughs> Thank you, Lady Ningguang. I'll You're be next. more excited to wear my fan clothes. What is your question? Uh, the obvious. Where's my brother? I should clarify. You're a mind reader, Ningguang! And I love trial It's like, well, you know, I know this bullshit. Will ask a question, then. Lady Ningguang. Do you think I can ever fit in in Liyue Harbor? Too slow, Paimon. Now that is an interesting question. Liyue Harbor is very inclusive. As long as you respect the rules here. That's a pretty you basic answer, though, Ningua. So, the key is whether or not you yourself can develop a sense of belonging in Liyue but Harbor. But sometimes the basic things are the most obvious answers. Oh, a sense of belonging? Yes. To become fond of a place, to feel part of it. It always requires a reason. Hey, what's going on? Mm -hmm. I just went to see the fleet a little later than Nothing's expected. happening so far in Guyan Stone Far and stuff. Come on, Because we don't know from Jia now, so I don't need to you pretend like, you know, the obvious isn't going to happen. 